everyone and welcome back to my channel. So I have a little midweek video for you guys today which I normally don't do. Well actually I don't really have a specific schedule but I normally don't really film this time of the week but I went to Priceline this morning and I went in to buy one thing and came out with more than one thing. So I thought that I would sit down and do this video for you guys today um, just in case you were curious as to what I got. Now, this is kind of like a haul, but it could also be classified as a drugstore dash. So, I'm kind of going to just call it a drugstore dash slash haul, maybe. Um, because I got five things and I literally did dash into Priceline this morning and picked them up quickly before I went to uni and then I left. But it's also a haul. Anyway, let's just get into it. So I'll start with the thing that I actually intended to buy and went in there to buy and that was just uh, some cotton, cotton rounds, cotton pads. Um, I buy the large ones and I use it um, with like a micellar water to take my makeup off because, and I had to get some more because I was almost running out so I just had to get some more. And I just bought the Price Sign brand ones because I'm not really that fussy with it so yes, got those. The next two things are a little bit boring, possibly. Um, it's these two top coat nail polishes, and they're both from Essence, and I got the quick dry one, and I also bought the gel look um, top coat. Um, I've never tried any nail polishes from Essence before, but from what I hear, they're not too bad of a brand and really, really good pricing as well. Um, these were both $2.95 each, I'm pretty sure. Um, and I bought both of them because I didn't know which one I'd like better and I wanted to try them both because I need a new top coat anyway because um, my one is kind of almost running out so I thought I'd give these two a go so I shall let you know how I get on with them next is the Rimmel BB cream the matte version and I got it in the color light and this was the last one left they didn't have like all they had was this super dark color and they were out of, this was the last light and there was no mediums so I was very fortunate to grab it um, because I've heard quite a few good things about it so I thought I would give it a go I've kind of been more onto the sort of lighter coverage bases lately I'm not really quite sure why because I don't have perfect skin but I just don't really like the feeling of a lot of makeup on my skin I don't know why, I'm just kind of going through this I just want a lighter coverage basically um, and then add some concealer where I need the extra bit of help um, so I thought I'd give this one a go because I love Rimmel and I've just heard good things like I said um, and I got the matte version because I do get quite shiny through the day um, so I don't always buy matte foundations but I generally find that with BB creams if I don't buy matte then it's a problem. So got that, shall see how that goes, hopefully I like it. And the last but certainly not least thing that I picked up was this Revlon Color Burst Matte Balm in the shade Unapologetic. And I love the name. Like, love it. Um, and it's a really pretty, I would say it's a pinky coral red sort of color. Um, and these are currently on sale for $10 at the moment. So I picked one up because I really like these sort of chubby stick things. I know that they're kind of maybe a bit done now, like, you know, they've been around for a while, everybody uses them, loves them. I've already got plenty, but um, I just don't have a colour that is like this in any sort of lip product, whether it be lip gloss or lipstick or anything. So um, I thought I'd pick it up because I just think it will be my go-to colour, or one of my go-to colours for spring and summer this year. Um, and I just fell in love. Simple as that. Well, that is everything that I picked up. Only a few things, only five, but I hope that you liked the video regardless um, and you like to see what I picked up and it might give you some inspiration if you need to duck in and grab something for no reason at all. I don't know where I was going with that sentence. Uh, I hope that you like this video. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe and leave a comment down below if you feel like it. Um, I've hopefully got some more exciting videos coming up soon. But I don't really know what to film, so if you have any ideas then be sure to let me know and I will get onto that for you guys. Um, and that is basically it from me, so I will talk to you guys again soon. Bye!